the school investigation is concluded by the administration of Delphi Community School Corporation. A local high school concludes its investigation into an alleged hazing incident. Good afternoon. I'm Jeff Smith. Thanks for joining us. In a follow-up to a story that News Channel 18 first brought you last week, the Delphi School Superintendent said, uh, says there was no sexual hazing involving members of the school's football team. News Channel 18's Alexandra Dyro has today's top story. Alexandra, what are we hearing now from the school corporation? Well, Jeff, this is the actual press release given to News Channel 18 by the Delphi Community School Corporation. The school corpora corporation held a press conference today at 3.30. It was led by superintendent for Delphi School Corporation, Ralph Walker. Walker states that they have concluded their investigation at this time. Walker says the school found no evidence of the sexual hazing alleged by a student football player earlier this month. The uh, school's investigation reveal that there was an attempted wedgie on a student football player by a couple of football players. There was no evidence of any sexual intent or sexual behavior whatsoever. Walker says the school corporation will not reveal the disciplinary action to be taken against the boys involved. Walker did not specify if the football team members involved would be disciplined. Walker says the school corporation con conducted its investigation in conjunction with the Delphi City Police Force. Chief of Delphi Police John Chapman says the police investigation is still ongoing into this incident. And coming up at 6, News Channel 18 will bring you more information on the police's ongoing investigation. Alexandra Dyro, News Channel 18.